This is from the Black and Media Fire HD Texture Pack Collection in the PS2 section. And then you have to search for Crash Bandicoot Wrath of Cortex, but I'll just leave a direct link to the textures. And then you just have to download the textures. After the download is complete, go to where you have downloaded the textures. And now we need to extract them. And if you're using 7-zip, which is the file archiver that I use, you can Alt Shift, right click on top of it, go to 7-zip and then select Extract here. Now go inside of this folder, copy or cut the folder with the game ID or with the game serial, then go to PCSX2, go to Tools, open Data Directory, go inside of the textures and place the textures or the HD textures folder in here. The textures are now installed, go back to PCSX2, then right click on top of Crash Bandicoot The Wrath of Cortex and go to Properties, then go to Graphics, go to the Rendering tab and here in the Internal Resolution, change it to a high resolution or you won't see much of a difference in the HD textures. Then go to the Texture Replacement tab and here turn on Load Textures and you can also turn on Asynchronous Texture Loading. Then go to Patches and here you can enable widescreen and no interlacing. You also have a couple of fixes and I'm going to enable all of them. Now close this, run the game and the HD taxes should be working correctly. That's it for this video and thank you for watching. No, it cannot be. Oh, no.